What's up, everybody? Hope everybody's having an amazing, blessed day today. I want to tell everybody just real quick before I get started with this action video to make sure you actually join us here on this platform, whether it be like and subscribing, whatever it may be, and then also join us on all our other social platforms as well, including our podcast and stuff like that. All those links are provided actually in the description of this video. Most of you know uh, me uh, with my reviews and stuff and everything. You know that I have uh, did uh, plenty of reviews on DoorDash. Done plenty of reviews on Uber Eats. I haven't done any yet as far as yet, as far as uh, Grubhub goes, but I do have a little bit of a review. I like to do the customer side, the restaurant side, uh, you know, the driver side of each one of these types of services. Uh, so I like to have my research done. That's the reason why I haven't done Grubhub yet. It's because I hadn't had enough time to actually do the research. If you're wondering what all these are, what the, all these are is they bring multiple different kinds of restaurants to your home, work, whatever, maybe you order it through the app. But today I want to talk about actual Grubhub on the actual customer side. It's going to be short. It's going to be sweet. Uh, the last six times I have tried to order with Grubhub with our address, it always pops up and it always says this. It doesn't matter if it's my wife's phone. doesn't matter if it's my phone, uh, Erica's phone, um, or anybody else's phone uh, that we try to actually use. That always pops up. So we have to go to the chat in there and ask them, hey, look, I'm trying to order what's going on. And it's weird because every single time we do that, it's almost like they flip a switch and the menus are there after we actually complain uh, that nothing is there, that no menus are actually showing up. Uh, they want to actually, you know, uh, complain that it's uh, all about, you know, uninstalling and reinstalling the app. Uh, you know, they want to say, hey, it may be your phone. All this other stuff or whatever, but it's not. Because regardless of what phone we use, regardless of how we do it, every single time that we have to do this from our area. It may not be in your area, but from our area, that is the way it is. Almost like they just wait for somebody to say, hey, look, I'm trying to order. And then they actually uh, shoot up the menus because... After we get frustrated and actually order somewhere else, I go back a little bit later uh, and go to actually uh, go into the menus and the menus are gone again and it shows the exact same thing again. So it's very, very frustrating. And then also as a driver uh, in this area, that makes it kind of iffy because if that shows up for everybody, then you know, you're not gonna get a lot of orders. And the reason why you're not gonna get a lot of orders is because of that. Not a lot of people are gonna take the time to contact them and say, hey, look, you know, your, your app is not working correct. I want an order. They're gonna just gonna go somewhere else. There, there's other people, there's Uber Eats, there's DoorDash, and there's other places as well that they can actually order from. So uh, if I have to give this as far as on the customer side and actual review, I hardly ever give anything a, a, a one out of five or maybe even a two out of five, but I'm gonna give this a one out of five only because of I have tried to order seven or eight times and I've actually only been able to actually order one time so uh, if the app works great you know it, it, it's awesome but here lately it's just like everything is not even able to order so I mean can't really rate it I guess if you want to put it that way I'm hoping to maybe possibly get you know some drivers together talk to them have an actual review on the driver's side as well like I did DoorDash and Uber Eats as well if you like this review make sure you actually like it make sure you share it that's the most important thing Share, share, share. I'd really appreciate this. I appreciate it on all of your actual social platforms. Uh, again, join us on all our social media. I never leave anything without letting other grace gifts is love. And we love you here. So we hope everybody has an amazing, blessed day. Bye-bye.